Hello and welcome back to Living Our Best Life. My name is Keith and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing and first look at the DJI Mic 2 Pearl White Transmitter. Now I only picked up the transmitter as opposed to the full set mainly because I already have the DJI Mic 1. I still think it's a fantastic mic set. I see no reason to upgrade to the full set. I mean the big thing that they're touting about this new set, uh, in addition to the maybe extended battery life and some improvements with the receiver, is the 32-bit float. And to be honest with you, 32-bit float, uh, if you haven't heard that word in the, until the last two months, it's because it really doesn't interest the average creator, the average person that goes out and films themselves uh, hiking or biking or family events or any of that stuff. So 32-bit float is really a non-starter for me. I have no interest at all in it. But the two things that I did have an interest in with this particular mic is the Bluetooth connectivity to my Osmo Action cameras, like my Osmo Action 4, as well as my DJI Pocket 3. It also works with your cell phone and it works with the Insta360 Ace Pro. Now, at this time, that connectivity with the Ace Pro is actually broken. The mic, the camera will still see the mic, but, and it will connect to it, but it will not record any sound. You just do not hear anything on your recording. Now, there's some workarounds. You can revert back to an older firmware and it'll work but uh, apparently Insta360 is actually working on the firmware to actually make this work again. So in the future, this mic will work with the Insta360 Ace Pro and Ace. So let's see just exactly what's in the box. I'm gonna go ahead and tear this thing open, I hope. With, with DJI, you never know. Okay, so it is, as you open the box, there is a little bit of paperwork. The actual package is enclosed in plastic. Sometime later, after struggling with the package, I finally did get it open. And it is a nice little little package. It's um, DJI on the front. It's a zipper pouch. And as you open that zipper pouch, it comes all the way around. And actually very nice packaging. I, I do like this a lot. Um, here is the, here's the star of the show, the actual mic. And I'm glad to see that it is plain white and it's not translucent like the one that came with the Pocket 3. And it has on the back this very, very strong DJI magnet. And I mean, when I say it's strong, it's much stronger than the old magnet. So there's the little magnet. Comes with the mic um, here. And the other side, we have the charge cable. And it looks like we have a white wind muff. But there's the white wind muff. So I think that's everything that's in the pouch. Again, very nice little pouch. I think this is really cool that DJI packaged this this way. So you get the, the wind muff, the charge cable, and the actual mic too. Now I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing charged, and then I'm gonna pair it up with my DJI Pocket 3 camera, just to show you how painless it is to get it set up and how it works. And then I'm going to do a, a little test with the Mic 2 at Bluetooth connected to the Pocket 3 and then 
compare that with the sound coming out of the mic one connected via the transmitter. So let me get this thing charged up and then we'll pair it up and see, see what happens. Okay, so now I have the mic, the wireless mic two. I have it in Bluetooth mode. I'm now going to hold down the link button to get it to start going into pairing. I'm going to go here to wireless mic. I'm going to tap transmitter one. And it says on the screen, confirm. It did connect to it. And as you see, now you see the green line moving across this mic is connected to my Pocket 3. That's all it is to it. It's very simple. Basically just hold down the button, push the button on the Pocket 3, it links to it, and now you can use that as an external mic every time you turn the power on to it. So. Now let's take a look at actually how it sounds on the Pocket 3. Okay, so now I do have it connected. The Mic 2 Pearl White Edition is now connected with my Pocket 3. And I'm going to be doing a, a little test. I have the mic about 6 inches from my face. And I'm just going to talk for a minute. And then I'm going to go and do a little bit of range test to get away from it to see how the Bluetooth sounds when you get some distance on it. I don't think that I'm ever going to wind up using the full distance, the capabilities of it, but it's nice to know it's there. But I do want to see how it does sound from a distance to see if the Bluetooth connection breaks up at all, and we'll see how that sounds. Okay, so now I am walking away from the mic. I'm going into the other room. I'm not going to go outside. I'll do this test outside as well, but just coming around in the house. There's a couple of walls in between me now, so um, there could possibly be some breakup. I have my back to the where the camera is, but and I'll walk back in to where the Pocket 3 is, and, and we'll see how that sounds. Okay. All right, so how does that sound? Did it break up at all? Now I have the DJI Mic 1. It is connected to the Pocket 3 with the receiver and I have the gain set to zero on both the mic and the transmitter so it would be a fair comparison. I've got the mic about six inches from my face. I'm going to just talk for a few seconds and get that sound out there and we'll see how that sounds mic one with the transmitter with the receiver hooked directly into the pocket three now i'm going to do just a little bit of range test i'm not going off i'm going to do the same route i did with the mic two i'm just going to walk into the next room just to get some distance basically the same route that i did with the with the mic two um, i have a couple of walls between myself and the pocket three and now I'm going to head back and just to see if we had any breakup of any kind see if the sound was solid okay so that's my quick unboxing and first look at the DJI mic 2 pearl white edition I haven't seen too many reviews or even unboxings of this so I thought I'd get that out there I picked mine up off of DJI's website. It was $99. And uh, from what I understand though, I think they have sold out of the, the white ones. Uh, it's possible you may find one on Amazon. So how did you think it sounded? Did you think it sounded as good as the Mic 1, better than the Mic 1? I, I am looking forward to using this. Uh, leave a comment down below if, of what your thoughts were on how it sounded and uh, what the package looks like to you. Is it something you're going to be interested in picking up or will you use it with your cameras? Uh, I'm looking forward to using it with mine. So 
anything that actually lessens the load that I have to carry. If I don't have to carry a, uh, a receiver and have to worry about a cold shoe mount, then that's a good thing for me. So, but I'm looking forward to getting out and using it. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you got something out of it, please like and subscribe. I'm still trying to grow my channel and uh, looking forward to making another video in the near future. Uh, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one.